while the chefs wait anxiously to hear their fate, the judges can see the full menus at last. They may well have their individual favourite dishes, but they can't pick and choose. They have to consider the menus as a whole and vote for the one they think is the most cutting-edge and inventive example of top-quality contemporary British food. We got off to such a tremendous start with both the first courses, but they both had weak moments. I mean, I can think of at least one course that I thought was more interesting than it was edible. <laughs> you know, you know yeah, what I mean? Yeah, I two courses of that. All right, so come on. Have you made up your mind? I've made up my mind. Yes, I, I have to. And indeed, so have I. I guess we need to bring in the chefs. It's crunch time. The chefs are called into the judges' chamber for the final verdict. Welcome, chefs. How are you feeling? Very nervous. For us, it's been a very difficult day, but we have eaten some, you know, what I consider to be world-beating food today. So I'm going to ask my fellow judges who they're voting for. Menu A. Menu A, Matthew. Menu A. I am also going for Chef A. That means it's a unanimous decision. So, Prue, could I have the envelope, please? The chef going forward to represent London and the South East in the final of the Great British Menu is... Jason Atherton, well done. Yeah, uh, Congratulations. Well done. Thank you. Yeah, well done, Jason. Jason, well done. You know, there was two amazing dishes there. You know, the starter, which I thought was absolutely incredible. And for your beef, which was just stunning. Everything was fantastic about it, you know, so really We even forgave well you for it not being particularly summery. We just thought it was so wonderful. Atoll, as always, an extraordinarily illuminating and graceful exercise in, in cooking, um, a, a wonderful individual style. But on today, I voted for Jason because when you deliver a, a dish, it has an extraordinary precision of flavour. And I think today you cook two absolutely outstanding courses, and the rest of them weren't too bad either. Jason, I'm looking forward to seeing you in the final. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Thank, you. Thank you, Matthew. Thank you. <laughs> There you go, guys. Thank you. And then one last vote for you, Atul. Oh. <laughs> Cheers, guys. <laughs> Sad that uh, spices will not be represented, which is culturally very British. But very happy for Jason because I do think he's he's really. Uh, Cutting edge chef. It was uh, one of the scariest things I've ever done, I think, going into that room. And um, but you know, I've come out victorious, and you know, I'm a very, very happy.